How's it going guys? Welcome back to another video. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys a brand new guide that's going to take your Roblox jailbreak trading experience to a whole new level. I'll be teaching you everything you need to know to become the best trader in jailbreak. So yeah, let's get right into it. First, to access trading, here's what we're going to want to do. You need to find the trade boat in the jailbreak map, which is located here. If you own the trading VIP game pass, you can also instantly teleport to the trade world. But once you're in the trading world, some things to do as soon as you enter should be to turn the music off and make sure other people's radios are off. People like to blast loud music in the trade world on their car radios, so I recommend disabling it. Trading in Roblox Jailbreak revolves around in-game cash, and there are many cars you should have before starting your trading journey. The best cars to buy to begin trading from cheapest to most expensive would be the Lambo, the Eclair, the Volt Bike, or the Concept. Saving up to either the Volt Bike or the Concept would be the most ideal thing to do to start trading, because the Concept is the most valuable, non-limited vehicle currently worth around a gold color, which is the OG color you got from playing Jailbreak in the first week of release. Now, trading values can be hard to find, but there are tons of reliable Jailbreak trading value lists out there. The best trading value website right now is jbvalues.com, which I'll leave a link to in the description. They have an official item value list with a majority of items in Jailbreak, and also let the community create their own value list too. Just some of the items on this website that you should know are the Concept, the Bruley, the Torpedo, and the Beam Hybrid. Whenever you're doing a trade, if possible, I recommend checking on this website using the calculator tool to see if it's a fair trade. I usually only do trades that give me more value. No one likes a bad trade experience. We'll go over some essential trading etiquette just so you always maintain a positive trading experience. Plus, we got some tips to ensure your trades are successful and scam free. When trading, you have the option to put a tag above your head where most people write what they're trading or looking for. Some examples can be trading torpedo, looking for Bruley, or if you're looking for a specific trade, you could do trading hyper red level 1 for Volt Bike. People also use many acronyms in trading, mostly LF, which means looking for. NLF, which is not looking for, NFT, which is not for trade, WYW, which is uh, what do you want to trade or, or why are you trading them. And when asking other people if a trade you're doing is good or not, you would say W or L, which is win or loss, or W slash F slash L, which is win, fair, or loss. Now let's talk strategy. We'll dive into various trading strategies from flipping items for quick profit to long-term investment. One thing many traders do is try to get new seasonal vehicles as fast as possible. If you're mainly in it for the profit, you could trade your brand new season vehicle as soon as you get it to get huge wins and overpay. Some other terms people use in trading is downgrading or upgrading, which is exactly what it sounds like. If you have your tag as trading blank for downgrade, it means you're trying to trade that specific item for multiple items that will equal the value of it. If you have your tag as trading blank and blank for upgrade, it means you're looking to trade both or all of the items for one or more items that will be equal to the value of it. To make sure you're not being scammed, always double check you're trading the correct items and that the other person is trading what they say they are. Many people also try to scam scam OG players by simply taking advantage of the fact that they don't know values and just asking them what they would want for a super rare item which most of the time are items that don't equal the value. But that's mainly all you need to know to get your trading journey started in Jailbreak. I also have tons of videos on what people offer for certain items and again you can also check jvvalues.com for all the values. If this video gets 200 likes I'll do an advanced strategy for trading in Jailbreak from the best trades for the most valuable item to the best strategies for trading. But yeah, I hope this was helpful for you guys. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos like this. I'll be doing a torpedo giveaway on my Discord server, so if you guys want to enter, the link will be in the description. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next one.